Okay, so I spent roughly 30 minutes just going back and catching stuff and battling stuff. I caught two Pokemon off screen, and uh, it was Nickit and the Galarian Zigzagoon. Let me go ahead and show that off real quick. Uh, I nicknamed Nickit Power. And then, uh, let me show you the Galarian Zigzagoon. Uh, wherever it is. Gooned with two zeros, because I love my spelling stuff. Uh, but anyways, I've been raiding some Pokemon. Goodest boy has been taking the lead. It's not very strong, but I still really love it. Bugsley is getting close to leveling up. Uh, and then I just have, you know, them in here. And, uh... Yeah, this is what I've been doing for a while. I changed my clothes. I got a purple shirt on and blue pants. Which, uh, the purple shirt, green jacket, blue pants, and red, uh, sh or excuse me, black shoes is almost exactly what I wear on my days off. I mean, it's, and the black socks. It's like, it, that's all, that's what I wear on my day off, or days off. And then, uh, I just add on the, that one orange glove, and, uh, of course, the bag's still the same. But yeah, so let's go ahead and take on that other trainer down here, wherever they are, and uh, move on. I spent quite a while just doing other stuff. Cute and strong, together in combination. Yep, that's me. Cute and strong. Last Lauren. Okay. Aw. She is cute, though. However, goodest boy is the cutest. So. Sorry, not sorry. You're gonna use tackle. You're not gonna use water gun. Why aren't you gonna use water gun? That's a smarter move to use. Now you're paralyzed. Now I'm going to kill your choodle with goodest boy. He really is the goodest boy. Really, you are not a very intelligent trainer, are you? With Water Gun, you could have done a, quite a good bit more damage than with Tackle. But it's fine. Alright. That was easy. You defeated last Lauren. Are we cute and nothing more? Looks like our strength still has a ways to go. Yep, sorry. You're just cute. That's it. Pokemon have types. And that's it. That's all she said. She didn't say anything else. You're another trainer. I couldn't beat Hop, but I'm gonna beat... Listen. What makes you think that you can beat me if you couldn't beat Hop, Benjamin? If that even is your real name. <gasps> it's a blip bug! How can I make myself hurt it only with the cutest Pokemon? Okay. So here we go. Let's go ahead and defeat his blip bug. It only has struggle bug. It doesn't have anything else. And I'm not really worried about it. A special attack fell. That's fine. You only have physical attack moves. Let's get Nuzzle. I don't really see myself using Pinata as a battler. More as just getting items for me. And struggle bug again. What else do you have in your as, as your second Pokemon? Oh no, not my special attack that I don't use because I don't have any moves to utilize it with. <laughs> Alright. Cool. Nick it. Let's go ahead and swap out to, uh... Oh, I just realized I don't have goggles with me. Let's see. You know what? I haven't used Munchie in a long time. So let's use Munchie. Good old Grookey. I need to bring uh, goggles back into the team whenever I get a chance. Branch poke! Oh, you gotta use quick attack, huh? Hiya! Wow, that almost killed you. Good. Very good. Take this. Branch poke. And you're gone. Bugs are leveled up to level 7. Lose to wild Pokemon. Lose to many trainers. 
Yeah. You're just gonna lose to everything. <gasps> yes! I knew it! What? Bugsley is evolving! Very good. Nice. Bugsley evolved into Metapod. Metapod data is added to the Pokedex. Even though it is encased in a sturdy shell, the body inside is tender. It can't withstand a harsh attack. And of course it learns hard. Nothing surprising there. Pokemon hiding in the tall grass or trainers waiting along the route. Which one you choose is up to you. Well, I don't really have to... I can't really choose the... Trainers. How'd I get a... Bike? What in the world? What just happened? How'd I get a bike? I, I don't know how I just got a bike. But I have one, and I love it. Whoa, the B button makes me go really fast. It has a, a recharge time on it. Just about ran over a zigzagoon. I, I don't know how I got a bike, but I'm sure it's fine. Okay, well now I don't have a bike. Give me back my bike! How did I just bike? Wait, I wanna... I wanna sit down for a while. Hey, that's... that's really strange... That I... Got a bike. Because I don't know how I did it. Um, and now I wanna know how that happened. Uh, is it in my items somewhere? Just activated by accident? It's not showing up any anywhere. So how'd I do that? Wait. So the clinging the left stick does that. The right stick doesn't do anything. Hmm. Now the D-pad... None of the D-pad buttons do anything. Um. Uh. Bike in. Uh. Sword and shield. Huh. I'm trying to think here. That's weird. Um. Let's see. Accident hold on. Accidental bike in sword and uh shield. If I could ever spell things. Um Let's see. That's weird. I'm not. I'm not gonna look at everything, but it's. I'm not really finding anything on like getting a bike this early. Apparently, you don't get a bike until later on. So I don't know what's up with that. Anyways, look, there's a professor. Well, now I wish I could get the bike again. So you have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness, no. The whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... Dear me, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guests. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. Okay. You say so, Granny. Why, Hop, dear, I see Wooloo has made some new friends. And you must be JD. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. I'm, I'm working on it. 
You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, J.D.? Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years, and it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokémon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know. Like how to get a bike all of a sudden. Like how many different types of tea there are. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why won't you endorse them? Hop and JD only just start out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads there you don't know yet. Deary, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Galar region become strong trainers. Isn't that right? Well, yeah. You're not wrong. That goal's precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Right then. In that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry. I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Right. I'll be waiting outside, JD. Oh, uh, that's good. Because I have to end the episode. Uh, and while I'm off screen, I'm going to be looking into that thing that just happened with the bike. So anyways, I'll uh, catch y'all in the next one.